Right, the last one in this little thing we got going on. Calm, calm down. Oh, excuse me. Right, I'm home alone, so I can shout as much as I flipping well want. Um, you've seen from the thumbnail and title, and if you have been keeping up, you'll know that the last one is chicken burrito flavoured. It is by Yucca Restaurant. Where's the it there? Yucca. Ooh, lovely. I love a bit of yucca. I've never been to Yucca in my life. I'm not planning... Well, I might, I might do if I... It's in West London. I'm probably not going to, considering I live in Wales. Um, yeah, I'm looking forward to these ones. I am really looking forward to these ones, because I do quite like a chicken burrito. Um, it's chicken. <laughs> Uh, that's what a chicken burrito looks like, if you don't know. It's basically like a tortilla wrap type thing with chicken, I think that's cucumber, lettuce, and some sort of pickle jar, or something. Not joking. <laughs> Bloody hell, Joe, calm down. Suitable vegetarians, even though it does say chicken. It's fr chicken. Oof. It's the flavouring. There's no actual chicken being put into these. So don't worry. Not that I'm a vegetarian anyway. It's all bollocks. Um. Again, you can get five pound off your local restaurant. Um, a nice yellowy orange packet. Um, these, as you can see, cost a pound. They are from a shop quite near me. Um, yes, um, I couldn't find these things anywhere, like anywhere. Um, I think in Tesco's they sold them in a pack of five, um, and I think that's about it. And in the post office where I got the Madras ones, couldn't see them there. They only had the uh, Madras curry and fish and chips ones. Sainsbury's, they only had them three. But these come in in a local shop called Glenwood Stores. And I had to pick them up because I wasn't buying a pack of five because I didn't like them. They're quite rare in the grab bag size, which is quite strange, I think. You know, why are these ones so, so rare compared to the others? It makes no sense to me. Um, uh, uh, these are red on the fat bit. Not sure if you can see that. It's red on the fat content. Um, it's orange on saturates and salt. Sugar's quite good, but they're probably still bad for you. Um, product contains season only. No chicken burrito. Luckily, our restaurant partners have it covered. So, if you actually want a chicken burrito, go there. Or, there's probably one local to you. Don't have to travel to West London. Um, let's just crack into it, shall we? Just, just get into it, you idiot! <laughs> right, they're open. They're open. One of them spurted out that Oh, again. That's what they look like in the packet. And again, they are half full. Or half empty, depending on how you look at things. Um, these are a lot darker than the others. I'm not sure if you can see that light and probably on it. You can probably see that. They're a lot darker than all the others. A lot. The others had a bit more vibrancy to them. But these ones don't. Um, ooh. Uh, my camera battery's going to die in a minute. Quick, get a move on. Very strong chicken-y smell. And then there's a sort of after smell. This might not make any sense because I don't. There's not really that much of a smell to it, but it smells a bit like lettuce, and I do like a lettuce. Um, lettuce goes quite well in, in sort of stuff. So yeah, let's just get into it. That's what the crisp looks like. See, I'm not. There's nothing to compare it to, but you probably can tell it's a bit darker. So let's get into it. Ooh. Ooh. Strange. Uh, you know. No chicken at all. <laughs> the aftertaste... Oh, hang on, hang on. Yes, it's an aftertaste of chicken. As soon as you bite into it... Oh, it's cucumber lettuce. There is no chicken taste whatsoever when you first bite to these. It's just pure vegetable. Pure vegetable, which I'm okay with, because I like them bo uh, both of them. Uh, actually, cucumber's not a vegetable, it's a fruit, but we won't get into that. Um. Mmm. There's a sauce coming through as well, I'm not sure what it is though. Maybe like a sour creamy garlic eat no. A sour creamy mayo type of thing. Sour cream and chive, maybe. They're really nice. If you like them sort of vegetables. I've never had a crisp unless I I've, I've seen them in the shops, the vegetable crisps. I've never bought them before. I've never had a crisp that just tasted pure vegetables and fruits and that. This is weird. They're really nice. They are really, really nice. But it's just strange how they just taste of pure vegetable. It, it's quite weird. It's an after taste of chicken. Not that strong, but the thing that stays on your tongue... Ooh, the thing that stays on your tongue is the cucumber lettuce uh, taste. Which, 
it's quite bizarre in terms of crisp. You expect crisp to be a savoury item, but you know, vegetables not really sweet. But how? These ones, there's a bit of a, mm, there's a tiny, a tiny um, spicy kick as well, I've just noticed, which is quite nice, but I urge you to get these. Not because they're the best, my favourite ones are still the Madras, uh, in my opinion, but I urge you to get these, just to try them, if you can get them, because they are quite rare. Um, get them, and please, don't just watch it and be like, oh yeah, I'll get them, and don't give me your thoughts. Please give me your thoughts in the comments, because... I want to know other people's opinions. It might just be my fucked up taste buds. Like, oh yeah, they taste like lettuce. No, they don't. But it does. Very vegetable-y. Very cucumber-y. With a hint of chicken. But they are quite nice. It's a it's a very nice change to a crisp. Um, It's that sauce. I'm not sure if you can see that. You can't. It's that sauce. It's like white. Uh, I think it's sour cream. Or like a, a garlicky mayo. Which is really nice. Um, now, that's the end of the little series. I, I'm probably going to rank them all now. Uh, my favourite is probably the Madras. These second, Thai Green Curry third, and the Fish and Chips fourth. Which is quite strange, because if I had to choose something at a restaurant, I would probably choose Fish and Chips. But in terms of the crisps, um, they're bottom. They're not the best. But these are nice. Um, what is actually the uh, ingredients before we uh, go? Uh Vegetable oils, chicken burrito seasoning, um, paprika, paprika extract as herbs, and there's vegetable karma, if I can know what that means. There's celery. There's celery in it. That's what I can taste. I, I don't like celery. Celery is one of them vegetables where you, like, loot, like, you waste more calories eating it than you actually gain, or something like that. It's got negative calories. So, what was the point in that? That might... Ah! Yes! The thing in the burrito is celery. That's what I can taste. It's quite nice in a crisp. Um, yeah, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this series. Probably find something else. Walkers will probably bring out some more crisps. Or I might go back to beans. I don't know yet. But they were lovely. Um, it's so different. It's so weird having just such a vegetable taste from a from a crisp. It's just quite strange to me. Yeah, I think you'll enjoy these if you like, you know, vegetables and shit. But yeah, thank you for watching. Um, uh, suggest stuff suggest stuff what I should do next you lovely boys and girls well not boys and girls you <laughs> lovely people um yeah this has been Joe um we'll finish that there get it uploaded Friday say Friday get it edited tomorrow tomorrow's Thursday yeah Friday it won't take that long cheerio get these please get these it's a nice uh that bollocks <laughs>